All right, Virginia Tech, Virginia. Uh, we have a uh, Virginia Tech three point road favorites, fifty two the total. What was that from Virginia Tech? Very disappointing. Now I know NC State. Look, either I under overrated Virginia Tech or I underrated uh, since or, uh, NC State last week because I really like Virginia Tech as a small favorite against NC State and NC State was pretty good in the line of scrimmage. They just both sides of the football. The offense went up and down the field against Virginia Tech's defense. That was definitely some of the. That was the biggest thing, yeah. I, and Drones yeah. definitely had one of his worst games since he's assumed the starting quarterback job at Virginia Tech. He really struggled against that NC State defense, especially early in the game. So we'll see if they can bounce back from that. Virginia Tech now on the road. Look, Virginia, look, they beat Duke last week. Um, they've been competitive. They haven't uh, mailed it in down the stretch, even after that bad start to the season. They found a little something here in Anthony Calandria. It's a rivalry game. Uh, Virginia, point spread wise, has been excellent to, to the tune of eight or seven and one ATS their last eight games. The only game they didn't cover was the loss to Georgia Tech. I mean, they've been a point spread machine here down the stretch. And in a rivalry game, now you're getting them at plus three at home. For Virginia or nothing for me. Uh, in this game uh, with the with point spread streak they're on. Uh, you look at head-to-head, Virginia Tech got them last year, 29-24. Even though they're only a 3-8 and eight team, 8-3 eight and three against the spread, they've been competitive and they've been in every single game, and it wouldn't surprise me to see more of the same here. I would look at a Virginia side, maybe a look at the over as well, four straight overs for Virginia, and this total looks a little light to me here at 51-52. Uh, what do you think here, Connor? Yeah. This total, I mean, rivalry game, but I I thought this was a, a little bit light too. It just even last week, because that Duke defense just wasn't there. That game got over the man that we were just talking about with Virginia. And I like Virginia here again. And they they've just been money. You know, they finally get a win at home. They were covering at home, even though they haven't been great. But just two and three now. They've been able to cover. So in a game like this, I think it could be a field goal game. I like the three with them. And you might be right. I think it just could uh, slip over. Virginia games, you know, they've been pretty good at the over, 7-2-1. and one. You know, Virginia and Virginia Tech slapped them around uh, a little bit the last 10 years. So kind of like uh, the Cavaliers here. Yeah. Again, two weeks in a row. Yeah, and look, um, they're in revenge for losing to them last year. They have a chance to knock Virginia Tech out of bowl eligibility if they beat them here. So there's reasons to be amped up for this game. If you're Virginia, even though you're only a three and 18, 